Hi and welcome to this week's Caddo at the Chateau, at the Chateau de Lalande. Today we are clearly on a bed. <laughs> well, because we thought it might be nice for you to see a different room each time we're opening the presents. Mm -hmm. Also, it's quite comfy. I didn't repair this one, eh? You, know you didn't? This one's a bit squeaky. No. It's it quite, look, it's still holding This up. winter, we will repair this bed. Right, yeah. Yeah. This was actually my bed when was I was young. Yeah, oh, yeah. This nice. was back in England, this was my bed. What a bed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a nice one, isn't it? I like this room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we're and in the Chambre Perse at the chateau now, in the old part of the chateau. And I think this is a nice place to open presents. So are we allowed a mince pie? We're getting yes. quite Christmassy in the house. <laughs> yes. Some mince tea. pie. I uh, actually... Tea. Wait, I think we need to wait just two seconds, because first, presents. Gift is the most important thing today, right? In this yes, program. true. Not and there's not nothing here. There's no tea in the teapot. No tea in the teapot. Because... I was brought under false pretenses. <laughs> I'm sorry to be like uh, saying what is going on in the box, but it's tea coming. Ah, <laughs> okay. ah, how do you know that? Because it says tea on the outside. David's tea. I have no idea what's inside. <laughs> yeah. So is that is that what's on the inside? I'm not known. I no. think it's you a always sauce. pee. You always pee. There is tea, black tea, cream of Earl Grey, cream. Mm -hmm. rich, creamy, and classic for alertness. Yeah, oh, okay. It's got a high caffeine level. Ooh, that's that? yeah. Can you drink oh, that's that? That's why now? it's for alertness. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, lovers of Earl Grey adore this creamy alternative to the original blend. We've added a touch of vanilla oh. for an unexpectedly rich taste. It goes vanilla So with you think nice we're going spice. mince pie? I think that's a very good idea. Okay, well, yeah. let's go for this. Oh, that smells super vanilla -y. Does it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Smell that. Coconut biscuits with butter Ooh. flavor. <laughs> and this was orange cream oh, biscuit. Oh, dash. enthusiasm yeah. over there. <laughs> Yeah, that would be good. I will open this one. Uh, uh, oh! <laughs> what? Crosby Martini pair. Yeah, they, they need the Waterford <laughs> Crystal. <gasps> wow, it's look like at the something size. It's like the Great Gatsby. Oh. Yeah, oh, that's really? a decent size martini. Yeah, it? Now, I love that it. That means I mean, business. Beautiful. Okay, dirty the old same? martini later today. <laughs> there were four on the bed and then four martini glasses. <laughs> <laughs> and I one said, roll over. Move over. <laughs> <I'll> move over. <laughs> to, That's have, your version of the song. They have, they have the same shape as the loo in the, the loo. The... Oh, do we you can, think these should be the bathroom yeah. martini oh glasses? <laughs> well, when you go to the powder room, and yeah. you just need a little martini before going back to the yeah, party. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wash yeah. your hands it's and got be like, that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Why not? I like it. Another cocktail Why corner not? in the bathroom. In the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is people would go in there to have a little gossip and then there'd be yeah. a massive yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. outside the door. I think now the kitchen will change to the to the loo. To the loo. Yeah, yeah. 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 The, the new kitchen. gossip corner. The, the yeah. Gossip Marie will be corner. delighted. <laughs> yeah, she'll yeah. have a bit of peace yeah. and quiet yeah. finally. She's These are so, so beautiful. But who are they from? Because John there's no Lipton. note. Joan. Joan. <gasps> Yes, Joan! Wow! I see you all the time in the comments. Yes. Oh, thank you so yeah. much for sending these. I can't believe how beautiful they are. And they're very sturdy as oh. well. Yeah. yeah, they are. And they're crystal. Yeah. Yeah, oh wow. That's very Christmassy. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> they're very beautiful. Do you think we should have martinis this evening? Mm. Just wait, I mean, please, people. Oh. Would you like some tea? Yeah, let's. Are so you getting the impression that she knows something that we don't know? Yeah, I kind of do get that I, impression. It's like I opening... know nothing. <laughs> really, I know nothing. <laughs> well, I think it's like opening presents with Yoda. <laughs> <laughs> Mini mince pies are the way to go. Oh, excellent ratio of pastry to filling. I want to try mm. everything. Mm hmm. Mm. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They're delicious. Mm. You know, I wasn't sure I was going to like this. And? It's absolutely lovely. Mm. Yeah. Oh, mm. I love vanilla smell. Yeah, it's not powerfully vanilla-y, it is just creamy somehow, even without adding mm. the milk. What do you think? It's oh. fantastic. Mm. It's nice. Mm. It's really good. Mm. I don't really like Earl Grey, but this one's kind of nice. 
It doesn't remind me of Old Grey no, very much. Maybe because the Old Grey is so, uh, for me, so perfume. Yeah, yeah that's you the same. two have an issue with Old Grey, yeah. don't you? But yeah. this is much mm. softer. This, this is nice. <laughs> yeah. mm, I love this. My mum mm. will say, don't eat in, <laughs> over the bed. Mm-hmm. We're having a fest yeah, here, mummy. No one's sleeping in this bed. We can no. make all the crumbs we like. <laughs> <laughs> this was amazing, but it didn't finish there. Here oh, Joan, you are spoiling two. us. It is Stephanie the Chatelaine of Lalande. Look at the beautiful box. Okay, but look at the card. Look at the beautiful fight like a girl. This is an epic Is card. that Star Wars? Yes. And I just said you were like Yoda. See, there's a Star Wars vibe today. Like Yoda? <laughs> Yeah, she's like the Yoda of gift openings. Like, she knows everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 ah, I see. <laughs> Dear Stephanie, I chose this card because it has the colours of your bedroom, plus, like Princess Leia, you are a strong woman. Best mm-hmm. regards, Joan. This card I'm keeping. Oh, yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> it's great. Wow, you wrote this in August 2020, in the year of the pandemic. Hi, Stephanie. I'm sending you Aviation Gin, box one. This must be box one. With four Waterford Martini glasses in box two. I was supposed to personally hand them to you upon our arrival last June, but because of COVID, that day has passed and gone. I particularly chose this gin because it's owned by another Vancouverite, Ryan Reynolds, who's personally donated $10,000 towards the Canadian Professional Bartenders Association to help its members suffering financially because of COVID-19 related layoffs. Bartenders are heavily reliant on tips, and so Aviation further added a 30% tip for every bottle sold online toward the association. Oh, God. That's very good. Really nice. I chose this particular design of martini glass because Waterford named it Marquis. Although I'm only a humble countess of Lalande, (laughs) it's also very similar to the ones Blake Lively, Ryan's wife, used in making her gin cocktail called Duke's Martini in the movie A Simple Favour. I love that movie. Yeah, I love. Also, the way she talks about how to make the perfect Mm. gin. Blake rinsed the inside of a frozen martini glass with vermouth, then sprayed the rim with lemon oil by squeezing the rind before pouring aviation gin. Apparently, it's a recipe from Alessandro Palazzi, who was the bartender at the Duke's Hotel in London. Here's how to make it. Wait, we've got mm. we've got the recipe. Mm. Okay, gin and glass. We're doing this tonight, okay? We're doing right. this one. So you just you have to freeze the gin and chill the glass for an hour. So we need to run and put those in the freezer. <laughs> then you swirl the vermouth into the glass and then get rid of it. Mm-hmm. You pour the frozen gin into the glass until it's two thirds full. Cut a wide twist of lemon. We have squeeze lemon. onto the surface and go. Oops! I think we might be in trouble, Joan. What? I've enclosed biscuits for Jerry. Ooh. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> so you didn't get any uh, from the NHS. This is my favourite biscuit whilst having my afternoon tea living in Hong Kong. The coconut reminds me of yeah, home. That one. Hope he likes it and shares it with all of you. He did actually yeah. share it with all of us, Joan. That's the first thing he did. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, Gerald. We saw the biscuits, we went mad. <laughs> Thank you, thank you so much, Joan. Well, I'm going to try the biscuits. <laughs> now that they're open, they would go soft. Mm-hmm. I love the bottle. Yeah. yeah, it's very Art Deco. It actually goes so well with the martini glasses. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah because the Art Deco style, well, which is the perfect cocktail style. I agree. Look at that. Wow. An aviation gin. Batch distilled with an adventurous blend of spices from around the world. Joan, thank you so thank you. much. Yeah, we're going to have a lot of fun with that yeah. tonight. The Oscar. Chateau family. Oscar. This is for all of us. Yes. You haven't peeked in this one, Natty. No, because it says what is it uh, outside. That's um, why I did it. Does it? Yep. I won't. Look, no, I'm not going to see. Oh, there's tools in it. No, oh, there you go. The light reading for you, Salma. What is this from? <laughs> Let's see what is this from. <laughs> Canada. I think oh. I can definitively say it's oh, from Canada. Oh, Canada. <laughs> it's a rowing boat with a deer on it. A statue, just. To... Yeah, it's a statue. Because look, and then you can see that's the actual boat. Right. So it's like painted on the underside. It's a kayak. Kayak. Yeah, with a little. Yeah, it's a kayak. Nice. What is it? I'm looking at the back first. Constable Valley Farm. Genuine Lord Nelson ware, made okay. in England. Oh, look. Wow. So is that one of Constable's paintings? I actually grew up very near Constable country, probably about half an hour from Dedham, where he painted the mill and where he uh, did a lot of his work. So this is, yeah, this is really reminding me of home. You've no idea. 
Thank you so much. And look at the rim. Yeah. I, I love the rim. Isn't Me it too. beautiful? Perfect, yeah. Just beautiful. What a lovely plate. Hmm. Thank you so much for sending this all the way from Canada and making me think of my childhood in England as well. There is a card! Oh. Dear the Chateau family, how are you guys? My name is Brayden and I'm from Canada. I'm 15 years old. Wow. <laughs> I've got a dog named Teddy. I like beach volleyball and music. What's your favourite thing to do in pastime? Hmm. Yeah, 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 you're dancing. Yeah, dancing. Me too. I love to dance and sing. I like eating. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, but that's Eating, new. reading, Netflix. <laughs> no, it's really embarrassing. It was not I Netflix when you were 15. <sighs> but it's not asking past tense, it's asking what do we like to do in our pastime? What do you like to do when you've got. Dancing, I was. Yeah. You're a great dancer. Yeah. Both of them are friends. amazing. I, like, I love to read. When I was young, I oh. read a lot, a lot. Yeah, me too. I never have time for reading. Yeah, reading, Mandy, reading. Reading, reading. Yeah. yeah. We should have a reading night where we all just sit in a reading club. A reading club. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we have a coffee club. That would be really nice. <laughs> this is an interesting question. I can speak English and French and German. What languages do you guys speak? Well, I speak English and German. So you speak French. Dutch, English, yeah. German. Yeah. You speak English, French, and German. English, French, and German. I'm embarrassed because I only speak English and French, which means I'm the least lingual person here. <laughs> Do you yeah, speak? Well, yeah. I barely speak Spanish. <laughs> barely speak English. <laughs> less barely speak Italian. <laughs> no, come on! You speak Italian, you speak Spanish, and you speak English, yeah. and you're learning oh, French. Oh. I'm learning French. Right. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. And you speak? I speak Dutch, uh, like the master. Dialect which is a language in its own. Mm -hmm. uh, English, German, French, and a little bit. You're all disgusting. Uh, uh, would you like some tea? We need to I cut these two languages. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's fantastic. Just speak. Oh, and he language. said um, best wishes in all three of the languages that he speaks. Best wishes, meilleur vœux, and best of vœux. Thank you Incredible. so much, Brayden. This Thank is you. absolutely beautiful, Brayden. I love it. Thank you. Charles Caleb Ward. Oh, he's Canadian. Yeah. But it looks a Canadian similar, artist. Yeah. Yeah. Hang on. I think they must have got the dates wrong of his life. Unless he actually lived from 1831 to 1996, in which case, presumably, he was a vampire. <laughs> yeah. But he painted this in 1891, so I'm going to guess he lived from 1831 to 1896, maybe? Otherwise, he'd be 165. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, maybe. <laughs> I mean, you live healthily in Canada, right? <laughs> That's funny that you see It's that. a lovely, lovely yeah. print. Isn't that gorgeous? No, he has an exquisite taste yeah. for Freedom, you do. You have exquisite taste. Mm. Thank yeah. you so much. Well, what is it? I don't know. It's from John. New York. New York, I think. In New York, yeah. There's lots of things in here. It's three boxes, so let's start with this one. There is a note. Stephanie and Thomas. Okay, Thomas, everyone is still thinking of you. No, you're not here anymore. Stephanie and Thomas, you mentioned that the one thing you have little of at their land is placemats. Well, I found this set and right away thought of Thomas's table settings and Mummy's garden and Marie the florist's table flowers. I hope you find them useful. From John and Carol. P.S. The little card, when I read it, says everything that Lalande is. I had to send it to you. This is the Magnolia Manifesto and it starts, we believe, in home that it should restore us from today and ready us for tomorrow. In friendship, because friends who feel like family are the best kind of friends and that nothing matters more than family. In seeking the balance between hustle and rest and learning to find contentment in both. Everyone deserves a seat at the table and everyone has a story worth telling. In human kindness, knowing we are made better when we all work together. In courage, in cartwheeling past our comfort zones and trying something a little bit scary every day. You had a biscuit <laughs> in the afternoon. You never do that. <laughs> That's true, scary, right? Yeah. This is scary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that failure needn't be a negative thing. Rather, we learn from our mistakes and fail smarter next time. Mm -hmm. In doing good work that matters and in choosing that, nudging others towards doing the same. The newer isn't always better. And that it's time for the pendulum of trend to swing back to the basics. In inearthing beauty, however hidden or subtle it might be, and finally, we believe that each day is a gift and that everyday miracles are scattered about if only we have eyes to see. And of all heroic pursuits, large or small, we believe there may be none greater than a life well loved. 
Oh. That could beautiful. be the Lalande manifesto. Yeah, it's yeah. beautiful. Stephanie Jarvis and all the Lalandas and Vaz Manieas too. Oh, look at that. Yes. Yeah, Very so. inclusive. <laughs> <laughs> Dear Stephanie, Mummy Percy, Dan the Gardener, Gerald the Scotman, Marie Antoine, Elusive Nick, Selma, Mary the Florist, Oliver the Artist, Michael Potts the Swimmer, Ian, Natalie, Thomas, who can do anything, Michael Petrick, Brother Billy, Gwendolyn, Baby Ernest, Michael and Mrs. Petrick Sr. and any of the wonderful Lalandas I may have missed. Oh, wow. <laughs> Hello to all yeah. you wonderful people. You've come to mean a great deal to me in the past four months. I've watched all of the vlogs from Lalande and from La Bamigne, some more than once. I love them all. Stephanie and Michael Petrick, you're so entertaining and clever and knowledgeable and fun to listen to. Mummy, you are priceless. I truly love it when you're in the vlog. Percy is one lucky fellow. Hi, Percy. <laughs> His intro sounds like your outro. Yeah. <laughs> Well, this is such a beautiful letter, I'm not going to be able to read all of it now. It's about everybody, yeah. Yeah, it's so beautiful because John has literally gone through each person. Oh, no. mm. For example, I might just read out Selma and your cute dog Diesel. It's too long. Selma, you're a man of many talents. I love your enthusiasm and your creative work, and I think your dog has found new and renewed life at Lalande. I love him. No. And there's a little there's a little section for every single person. Oh, so this cute. is just beautiful. And we will read this off camera. Tonight on the table. Yeah. With the dinner. <laughs> yeah. John and Carol. That's a beautiful letter, thank you. Oh, wow, look! Oh. Wow. Can you have their perfect phone? Summer, Summer garden, garden party! <laughs> <laughs> okay, well these these are the actual placemats. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. They're different sizes. Oh, this is the runner. They're beautiful. Whoa. I love the edge. Look at the edge. The thing is, you're right. You nice. joke about me loving things for summer garden parties, but come on. <laughs> yeah, this, was, yeah. Oh, this is going to be nice. For a garden. I keep on keep saying, no with the strawberry plates. I love the <laughs> strawberry <laughs> plates. <laughs> Stephanie, for those quiet quiches down by the old mill. Because when I went to the old mill with Michael Petrick, we forgot to take the knife. We took oh, the quiche. Yeah. We had <laughs> no knife. We had to wow. cut it. Whoa. This is to start fires. Oh. Wow. And this oh, is cool. to cut things. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. That is a knife. Yeah. It's a five-hole knife. Oh. That the looks next, next nice for a quiche. The next walk oh. to the woods. <laughs> it's nice to me as well. <laughs> Watch this is apparently a fire starter. A fire starter? Don't try it here. We're in a very flammable. Have you ever been burned down once due to a fire? Yeah. Oh, it's a whistle. It's a whistle. Maybe rub that, that end over I that. I don't know. Are you trying to start the fire in the bed, Sama? No. Okay, we don't know how I to use it... a fire starter, but we're going to look it up. It would be really embarrassing, like, how did the fire start? Well, we were trying to start a fire. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. Yeah, it goes by your outfit, eh? Yes. The queen. Ready uh, for that's for your... Uh, Lara Croft. <laughs> right? Yeah, that's yeah. for your next trip to, to Africa. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So it matches my right. outfit as well. Yeah. Which yeah. is really like, amazing. I swear Ooh. I never say to her which colors we... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is just magic like that. Oh. Oh. Knives. Sabatier oh. knives. Our kitchen knives are shockingly bad. <laughs> this is amazing. Wow. 21. <gasps> With a built-in knife sharpener. What? This is so kind of you. This is such a thoughtful gift. Oh, whoa. That goes directly to the kitchen. Wow. And that's the knife sharpener here. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Can we fill it? Yeah. Okay, everyone. Oh, scissors, scissors kitchen scissors. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> With a place to live that they're exactly. never then allowed to they move live from. Oh, there. oh. You see? That's it. That means business. I think that maybe here. Oh. Oh, oh that. the fork. Yes. Mm. Oh wow. Oh. It's like a little bread knife. Oh yeah. Well, that's really oh, nice for baguette. Yeah. Ah. That one can maybe go here. That one can go yeah. there. That one can go there. Ooh, like this one can yeah. go here. This is really fun. This one? You'll Ooh. see better than from there. It feels like Christmas Day. Almost makes me want to cook now. Almost. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get too excited. <laughs> wow. Well, thank you so much, John and Carol. 
this is going to be used every single day, several times a day, yeah. without fail. I guarantee <laughs> these will be lost by the end of the week. No. And we'll have to send a no. search party to find them. <laughs> but then we'll know we'll just keep replacing scissors in the front. <laughs> and potlins. I love it. The men have swapped around because they're getting cricks in their neck. <laughs> <laughs> and the leg. Yeah. Yeah. yeah more it's comfortable. not that comfortable to be in bed. Yeah. <laughs> in the middle is fine. Oh, <laughs> fine. This is great. <laughs> oh, this is from Stefan Pelios. Yeah. Here's is a note. Oh, the 50 laws of freelancing, the insider secrets. Every freelancer must know. Stephanie, after all the hours of entertainment on YouTube, plus you sharing your story with my interview, I thought it was my turn to share with you. I wrote a book. Check out page 31 for the story of how your channel and our interview helped my business grow. And this isn't in the book, but how it helped me explicitly recover from a massive COVID-related drop in business. Looking mm -hmm. forward to a trip to La Lande soon enough, Stefan. Stefan, I'm so happy to hear that. It was really fun doing that interview with you. Stefan is a lovely guy from Canada and he interviewed me about just the huge rise in the viewership of this channel mm -hmm. at the start of COVID and how it had changed all of our lives here. Yeah, you could say that. I'm a freelance writer, but one huge passion of mine is French Chateau. I love the history, the architecture and the grandeur of it all. So I watch YouTube channels by people who own French Chateau. One of them was the Chateau Diaries. I eventually asked to interview the owner of the channel about how she grew her YouTube, which would fit perfectly for my blog, pulseblueprint.com. That interview has turned into my number one driver of SEO traffic by accident, <laughs> bringing me thousands of clicks every month, which drives not only ad dollars, but also provides a great story I've used to close multiple paying clients. Indulging my interests pushed my business ahead. I'm so fantastic. happy about that because I didn't know that it, it happened fantastic. afterwards. So, Stefan, I'm super, super happy to hear it. And I really hope we see you soon because Stefan was going to come here as a volunteer oh, yeah. and then obviously COVID stopped yeah. all of that. So, yeah. really hope to see you here as soon as possible. And this is another parcel from Canada. What? Like okay. I choose Big Canadian <laughs> day. <laughs> yes. I just said that's coming from Canada. From yeah. Vera in Canada. Look at that tissue paper. And more. If only mummy were here to see it. We can keep it for her. Yes. Look at that tissue paper, mummy. Dear Stephanie, thank you for your wonderful videos. One of my favourites about Cyril the Squirrel. <laughs> That's before... Were you here for Cyril the Squirrel? No, it was last year. It was a long time ago. I remember you mentioned yes. when I came here. Yes, and week. there was a squirrel, or so we thought, in the kitchen. And it turned out to be a type of dormouse, which had oh. a big, fluffy grey tail, this oh. big. Wow. And it, it was so naughty, it used to sit on the copper tap and then just be too fast for us to ever catch it. <laughs> but we sit there, this squirrel. That's great. <laughs> Cyril the squirrel. We caught him and we relocated him. We had a humane trap and we right. took him really far away. And then we caught him again <laughs> the next day and again the next day oh. and again the day after that. And it turned out that there had been four identical <laughs> <in the kitchen>. <laughs> 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 They all got relocated. <laughs> oh... Oh, oh is. This, I just have something in my oh, oh, I can't oh, wait yeah. for oh. Nick to see this. Nick loves squirrels. He is going to go crazy. This, is, oh, beautiful. this beautiful. Look, he's holding. Mm. <laughs> so good, Mira. <laughs> Look at his expression. It is a very good mm. painting. It's, uh, he's sending a postcard to his. Uh, yeah. 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 I, all yeah. Lounge. <laughs> I spent a happy time in the kitchen, <laughs> sitting on the tap. <laughs> very beautiful. Vera, it's superb. I just love it. It's so good. Vera, we love it. We, we all love it. Yeah, huge gold frame. We'll take it with us next time we go. Good. Oh, thank you so much. This is crazy because I've just had a closer look at the card. And we've just noticed that it's also by you, Vera. And it's so good. <laughs> it's it's a mouse standing on a Tiffany box, holding the little bag and wearing what presumably are the earrings <laughs> that were inside. <laughs> looking very, very pleased with herself. Mm -hmm. You're so talented, Vera. Really, that's just glorious. Back to US now. Ah, now, where in the US? Florida, right? Florida, oh. yes. Oh. 
Isabel. Ooh. Okay. <gasps> oh, mommy! Oh. <laughs> oh, mommy, Isabel. <laughs> I cannot <laughs> wait what to is, see her face a, with this. It's a bag. Yeah. I oh. always call Nick Eeyore because he reminds me a lot oh. of Eeyore. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. This is kind of making me want to go to Disney World. Have you all yeah. been in Disney World but me? No. Monday we have to go. <laughs> Why don't we do a little outing there when yeah, lockdowns are over? That would yeah, be amazing. We'll oh my gosh, that would be lovely. It is so yeah. good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we will. We will. Okay. You're so close to Paris. Ooh. Oh, what? Wow. Just the most beautiful fabric imaginable. Oh, oh, oh I love it so much. This is yes. original design by Harrison Howard. Harrison Howard for PK Lifestyles. Mm -hmm. I think it's stunning. Look at that bridge. Wow. Can you imagine something like that in oh. the garden, Selma? And then we can make it the tea pavilion. And we'll meet there for vanilla Earl Grey. Do you need no water then? Oh no, we still need a lake. And maybe on an island on the, <laughs> the lake. Island. Yeah? Yeah. The island on the lake. I love the black. That's so black. The Beautiful. Mm. <gasps> and look at this one. Oh, it's more. There's, There's colours. More. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh sorry, Selma. <laughs> so I keep hiding. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. Look at the pagoda. Yeah, this is a pagoda, not a pergola. Like. You see, you're all <laughs> getting excited about a pergola. The garden. We have to dance. With tea in it, dancing there. <laughs> 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 we'll start off by having tea in this one. No, no, you then we'll have dancing in that you one. You set up the tea around tables, and then you can eat and then do a dance. Is that how you do it? <laughs> 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 This is tissue paper. This is what? This is a heaven of the most beautiful tissue paper in black twelve. <gasps> you ever seen anything so lovely? I mean, I'll never bring myself to use it. <laughs> For Christmas, this is going to be amazing. It is, isn't it? We could do wrapping with this. Mm. It's beautiful. <laughs> I love that. And this is Ryan too, see? Wow. Maybe the note is inside this one. I mean, the box oh, this itself wow. is me, honey. an amazing no gift, look! Oh, I don't want yeah. to open it! <laughs> wow. I just want the to open it! The note must be inside, oh. Stephanie, you need to open it. Yeah. Oh, it's just, it's like an Easter explosion. It's beautiful, it's huge. It's amazing. I really like it. <laughs> me too. Yeah. Ryan, I know, it's so pretty. It's very beautiful. Whoa, me too. Yeah. I really think so. Me first, me first, number one. Look at that. <laughs> it's the cutest yeah. thing ever. Yeah, Dearest Goddess Stephanie, Ooh. we have spent so many years sleeping in the cabin at our grandma's house and all we have ever dreamed of is to be part of a fabulous Easter celebration like you have every year. So we asked Ryan to wrap us up nice and send us on our wonderful journey. Would you help our dream come true? While we excitedly wait for Easter, can some of us join our family on the shelf in the kitchen? Also, a few of our Christmas friends wanted to tag along for reasons you will understand when you see them. Thanks for being wonderful, beautiful and joyful. Your new celebration friends. <laughs> oh my Did, gosh. Didn't I say it reminded me of Easter? <laughs> yeah, totally, totally. Oh, let's find out who are our new Easter celebration friends. Well, first, yeah, the beautiful. amazing wow, ribbon. It's beautiful. <gasps> well, wow. is there even that he Did used for this? Yeah. Oh, oh, the tissue paper. <gasps> it's a marble egg. Oh. Oh. My father absolutely loved these. We and have we have four, I think, because he mm. loved them so much. Mm. This is a yellow one. Oh. Look! No. <gasps> they make me think of my father so much. Yeah, it's let's all go eggs. for it. Do you want to open, oh, yeah, sure. open eggs? Oh, I love this oh. color. Yeah, Look another, at that. That's a beautiful color. <gasps> this one's a porcelain one. It was much lighter. Look, it's speckled. Oh, look! This is, oh. Look at that! Oh. That's, a, that's a wild one. That's a very exuberant egg. Is this a glass? Or what is that? Oh yeah, that's glass. Oh, there's more. Oh. All the box has more this and more. This one's yeah, super oh. pretty. Oh, well, look, the Easter table is absolutely yeah. sorted this yeah. year. Yeah, this one's oh, glass. This. Oh. That one's pretty. But I like the yellow ones. Oh, the yellow ones. The yeah. yellow oh, ones. Oh, 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 this one's really nice. Oh, what do you oh, have there? Look, it's like a swirly one. That's not an egg. Not, not an, an egg. egg. Not an egg. Not an egg either. Yeah. An egg. I have an egg. Yeah. Really pretty. 
really pretty. <laughs> They're all combined. Oh. They're beautiful. Mm. I really like that yeah. one. I think that's my favorite. Of, yeah. Of, yeah. I like that one. Yeah. No, that's like it. This one. That's it. Could this be the Christmas friends that came along oh. for the ride? Oh. oh. Okay, that's actually unbelievable because you must have sent this a few months ago and I just said how we were going to have napkin, napkin rings, rings to keep in the dining room. And you must have sent this long before I said that. I did not know that napkin that. rings with peacocks existed. Oh. I, honestly, I, I have no I idea. Really wow. They, they are beautiful. They're really and there's beautiful. four of them. Yeah, they look very Christmassy. Oh, they do. In fact, we've got a napkin right there. Should, oh. we, should we give it a shot? That looks so good on oh, those. Oh, it's beautiful. I love it. Beautiful. <laughs> so and they even stand up. upright, you see? Yeah, yeah. made that they will actually stand upright on and the table. Rolling, rolling over the table. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Amazing. Everyone needs to choose a favourite egg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you go that with one, that, that, I will one. go with... No, I, I like this really like this one. I like the green one. I like this one. What's your favourite egg, Salma? Maybe that. Yeah, that's very, very beautiful. Mandy, you like this one, so I yeah. will have this one. <laughs> so nice. Ryan, thank you. Yeah, really, very, beautiful. Very, very much, mm. thank you. We just they're found a beautiful. couple that we hadn't opened. Super beautiful. So many eggs. This is great. <laughs> Can't wait to do the Easter table. <laughs> this one says, Signorina Stephanie Jarvis, and it is from Italy. Italy. Mm. Italia. Italy. Mm. Signorina. Lovely, so. lovely card. Dear Stephanie, these calendars have been sitting in my desk drawer for a long time. I've not had the heart to throw them away and think they would be very pretty framed. Unfortunately, mm. I don't have any free wall space. I'm a North London expat just outside Florence in Tuscany and thoroughly enjoy your vlogs. I'm passionate about houses, interior design, art, antiques, embroidery and pretty things. I would love to come to Lalanne as a volunteer with my Scott dog Teddy, a Scottish terrier. Oh. <laughs> Friend for Diesel. Yeah. <laughs> I do hope that you find a place for these prints as you are lucky to have a lot of wall space. Greetings to the Laland crew. Best wishes, Charlotte and Teddy. Okay, these do look really beautiful. Are they all different? Oh. They're all different years. Oh. Yeah, do you want to look through one, Salma? Yeah, of course. Oh, look Whoa. at these colors. I see in a whole, a whole wall. Look at this. Mm, yeah. um, all framed identically. Yeah. I, I, I love them. Yeah. You wanted to make a... Yeah, uh, yours is all with them. Um... Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. If we ever do the conservatory. See? These will be in there, but I love oh, walls like that. The, mm. Every frame the, the same and then yeah. tightly the spaced. That's good. A badger. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you want the badger one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the mouse. Sorry, I love That's mice. a dormouse. We had those in the house. <laughs> with a with like, like masks. Masks. Uh -huh. like the, like, like little masks. Oh, they look like yeah. little thieves. Yeah. Little yeah. Thieves, yeah. Well, actually, the first night uh, we had one called Dorian, and he <laughs> Dorian turned Dormas. up. He turned up on the night of our masked ball. Oh. And he was so tiny, he'd been abandoned by his mother, and we nursed him back to health. And he used to live in Nick's hair. He loved it what? in his hair. Really? Yeah. Well, Nick has shorter hair. Than you two, but it's like equally yeah, like thick yeah. and curly. Mm -hmm. If I, it's like what I have being to say. in Nick's yeah. hair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, these are beautiful. Yeah. Squirrel. Squirrel. It's a squirrel day. Squirrel. <laughs> See, I saw the badger. I was like, yeah, the this is gonna be flies. my favorite one. <laughs> Look, there's a lot. Little owl. <laughs> Sorry, I don't think <laughs> 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 We've lost Philip. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's so Cyril! Bad. Cyril the squirrel! He looked just like that. I saw it here too. Yeah, it's a stamp of the West. That is Cyril oh. the squirrel. It's like he's come home. <laughs> so we've got 12 times. Wow. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 120. 120 prints. This is a fantastic gift. Just fantastic. Ten years of... I can't believe it. It is hard to throw away. We're going to find the perfect spot for these. Definitely. Just have to wait till I can afford 120 identical frames. <laughs> <laughs> but it's going to look so, so spectacular when they're done. It's, it's definitely worth it. Thank you. <laughs> we have another parcel here. Ooh. But this parcel has a long story. Oh, I like long stories. Story. Right, I'm settling in for a long story, <laughs> Natty. Well, not that long. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is that we found this parcel just like that. And there's nothing, no name, no nothing. I thought that it was 
inside another parcel that yeah. we open and everything, mm -hmm. but we cannot find. We watch all the videos. <laughs> I've never seen Monday, this parcel before. And if somebody so there we don't is watching this, Ooh. just email me, please. Send a message because it's beautiful. Oh, oh so beautiful. Yeah. Set of 24 paper doilies. Use them to decorate for serving food and protect your table. Printed with vegetable oil-based inks. They're amazing! Yeah. Vegetable oil-based inks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and look, they're just paper. They can be beautiful with the, the blue plates. Okay, mm. white plates. The, a place setting with this. Yeah. 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 Just, it's but stunning. they're really kind of single use. Yeah. Any food gets on that. Maybe I can lock her. Mm. With a varnish, do you think that would work? Yeah. We could try it out on one, couldn't mm. we? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Yeah. I would like to keep reusing yeah. these because they're so pretty. And maybe yeah. you can make a little thin boot under it. And, and then lacquer. Yeah. But it would be so gorgeous because then we could have the blue and white set. Maybe you can yeah. save All it. The... <gasps> you genius. It's on the list. <laughs> on the list. <laughs> okay, well, I'm handing these straight to you, Salma, because that do. would be... Because yeah. else you can use them one and get yeah. something Yeah, yeah it would be such a yeah. pity because yeah. they're beautiful. Yeah, you have to, to save so, them. If that, you're watching, yeah, oh, we don't tell know who us. to thank, but <laughs> thank you, New York. New York again, dear Stephanie. This small gift of my handmade necklaces and earrings are my thank you for making the isolation during lockdown tolerable. I chose these colors as they remind me of you and mm. Laland. Best nice. to you all, Gail. Well, I think that <laughs> Mandy, Natty, and I are more excited than. <laughs> so, at the moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wow! Oh. <gasps> I mean, wow! Whoa! Oh my gosh! Well, you look. And you, you can know. look, look, look. You can make like, them. I wow. love this. And then you, and your, look, your, your favorite color. Oh. Look, your favorite color as well. Oh whoa! And there's <laughs> okay. Not there's Christmas matching anymore, earrings. Yeah, I love it. And it's just three girls here now, yeah. right? I know, there's only yeah. three of us. Yeah. I'm Mandy. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's, 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 that's Looks amazing. Good. It's nice colors. Yeah. Yeah. Voila. 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 <laughs> They're very nice. I love them, Gail. Yeah. They look amazing on you with your dark hair. <laughs> Whoa. It looks so good. Thank you. I really like this one. Mandy, shall we, shall we see you with yours? Yeah. Okay. Wow, I love it. <laughs> it looks so good. Ear, ear holes, but... Yeah, but we make uh, I make clips for you. So my is going to pop a pile, pop a and <laughs> matching my socks. Matching the socks. So perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Ooh, from Dunalen, US. In the US. Where in the US? Yes. Uh, just checking. It is MD. I'm going to guess Maryland. Can we guess? MD? Steven and Donalyn. MD. Sure. Now you said Maria, like I can't think of anything else. <laughs> yeah, no, I just looked and I was right. I right yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting good at this. Wow. Well, <laughs> wow. Masks. Yeah, no, but no, no, not just any mask. A mask and a corset. Oh. <laughs> not just. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so someone else can be matching <laughs> as well. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> this is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited, sorry. <laughs> Hello Stephanie, I hope you, your family and friends are doing great. I made this corset identical to my daughter's pictured here. She too loves to dress up and go to parties and renaissance fairs. I hope it fits you. I've included a stomacher just in case. Plus, masks to match. Belated happy birthday. I really enjoy watching you and your happy personality. Lynn mm. from Maryland, USA. P.S. The boning are zip ties and the fabric and ribbons are polyester. The lining is cotton. Just for your information. And Aww. there's my daughter. Wow. Right. Please excuse me, everybody. I cannot believe how well this fits. I mean, it's as though it was tailored for me. How did you do this, Lynn? I don't crazy, understand. Yeah. Also, with a mask, I feel it gives a bit of a handmade tail twist because here I am in something very old fashioned <laughs> with a mask as well. 2020 chic. Just beautiful. It's so well made. It's an incredible look at the back. And I've never had a proper pair of stays. These are the first. I've made corsets to go under specific dresses, but never proper stays. So now that I have this, I want to make a dress specifically to go over it. I absolutely love it. Oh, no. It's fantastic. Can mm. I just wear it like this as a top? You sit over with it. 
under. No, I want to make white wine to go over, over it. it. Yeah, but like the with a little bit showing here. Yeah, that's also lovely. Frame. That's a lovely that's idea. That's true. Yeah. 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 No, you're right. I should yeah. also okay. make a dress, like a skirt to go underneath. Yeah. yeah. That's right. And maybe a little jacket. Roughly that things. Open. Oh, one of those oh. roughly tops. Oh yeah. Another <laughs> Duchesse d'Orléans, like on oh, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Another dress for her. I have to get the golden fabrics out that I haven't used yet. <laughs> Big skirt. How do you feel like sewing, Philip? Now we know your <laughs> sewing skills. Yeah. I'm sorry. Sure. Yeah. We can we craft project. together. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Lynn. I think this is going to be a perfect winter project for me to make the rest of the outfit to go with this. I wanted to stay in the stays, stay in the stays, um, all the time, but it's a bit chilly in here, so I've had to put the jumper back on. But pretty much from the spring onwards, I might try and wear them every day. <laughs> Maybe with different beautiful. skirts. I just love yeah. them. For Stephanie and Isabella. <laughs> so, Mummy, something else for you. Oh, oh, look, a beautiful wax seal with, with a crest. Oh, yeah. She's saving yeah, it. Yeah. She's saving it. Ooh. And she's oh. saving it. <laughs> <laughs> See, the knife's coming very handy already. Oh. You've probably been missing a few words. Yes, yeah, a few words, but I'll just look up. <laughs> Chateau Lalande. Dearest Stephanie and Isabella, enclosed within this humble parcel, you will find a bit of something hand-bound by myself. Mm. From the cutting of the paper, folding each sheet into signatures, sewing each signature to cords, attaching boards and covering in leather. The leather tooling was applied using tools as they would in the 18th century. Mm. I cannot wait to look in here now. Isabella, your passion for gardening inspired what you will find. Two titles, one being a pamphlet originally printed in the 17th century and the other a bound volume printed in the 18th century. Both are reproduced by us from original copies. Wow. The wee book is bound with blank pages to be filled as you see fit, maybe with garden notes. I've sent along a reproduction porte de crayon to help with that. Stephanie, you will find something in red. I felt red would be fitting because you're full of energy, strength, power, determination, as well as passion, desire, and love. You love Lalande, and it is my hope that you will fill its blank pages with all things Lalande. I thank the two of you and every member of Family Lalande for being such an inspiration and for allowing me to live vicariously through each of you. Paul McClintock from Common Hand Studio, Isle of Whidbey, Washington State, United States. I can't you know. wait to yeah. look at this right, no. and, and, and also the just the way the letter yeah. is yeah. made. It's such attention to detail and such mm -hmm. beautiful words. For Isabella. Oh, mummy, I wish you were here to open <laughs> these in person. Oh, but even look at that. Wow. Paul A. McClintock, book binder and stationer at the sign of the crown and book, binds mm. and sells all sorts of stationery wares. www.fromcommonhands.com Every detail of this is perfection. It's making me want to get things like this printed for gift wrapping. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's just beautiful. It does feel like an 18th century parcel. It does yeah. with the brown paper <laughs> yeah. as well. I'm loving it. I should still be in the stays. Yeah. Oh, I shouldn't have taken them off. <laughs> oh, leather press. Wow. And you hand tooled this. The gardener's pocketbook or country gentleman's recreation being the kitchen, fruit and flower garden displayed in alphabetical order. Hmm. And this was originally Lovely. printed in the 18th century, I think he said. It was originally printed in London for the price of sixpence <laughs> with many curious hints towards the improvement of trees, fruits and flowers, the whole calculated according to the new style. The wow. new style? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> new style. <laughs> Nettle, seldom sowed, growing wild in plenty. <laughs> yes, I agree. This is beautiful and mummy is going to go crazy when she sees this. And this, the gardener's monthly directions showing what is necessary to be done throughout the year. December. Although this is the darkest month of the year, Phoebus being in his most southern declination, <laughs> yet it is seldom the coldest. However, little can be done in the garden besides cutting and pruning of wall trees, digging and dressing of ground against the spring, and such like preparatory works abroad. The evenings are long, which gives the industrious opportunity to indulge themselves by the fireside over a glass of heart's ease. Could I have my glass of heart's yeah, ease? She said, she said glass. Thank you very much. Everybody was actually hungry. 
and the studious leave to read what others have wrote, that he may make what he finds there and thinks fit to be his own, when fairer and milder weather too often invites him to partake of those pleasures the garden yields, to the neglect of his study. So, mummy, <laughs> you need to be studying in the winter months so that you are ready as soon as you get here to be working in the garden. <laughs> With the old S's as well. I know. Like those? Yes, all the F's instead of S's. If the weather be open and mild, you may remove or plant most sort of hardy trees that shed their leaves in winter. Laurel, bays, myrtles, laurus, filaria, plain coloured and striped rosemary of all sorts, gilded box, gilded holly, primroses of several colours, snowdrops, striped periwinkle and all other winter greens. Plain, gilded and striped, seem acceptable to the curious at this season, when the earth is locked up, that it cannot expose its more desired rarities, which in the succeeding year will every day begin to appear as the sun advanceth, and by its warm rays sets at liberty each flower in its season. Hmm. What a beautiful book! Oh, wow. Well, could you put my heart's ease down, please? Because <laughs> sure. I'm going to open the other parcels. Yeah, you have three more, right? Or two oh. more, at least. Yes, there's another one for Mummy. <gasps> oh, my. Oh, and this... With Mummy, you're going to love this. Again, it's all hand-tooled, the leather. So beautifully done. What look, is that? look, look, look. Yeah, this. Okay. Wow. Charcoal pencil. Oh! <gasps> wow. Beautiful. Wow. It's really one of the most yeah. beautiful things I've I ever wanna seen. Take, I want to take her his website. Paul, you're so of... talented. Mm. I, I'm amazed by this. <gasps> I love red. Red is one of my favorite colors. Yeah. Yellow first, <laughs> and then red and fuchsia pink. Right. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I love it so much. Beautiful. I wish I had yeah. something wonderful to write in it. Oh, you don't write. Nothing, nothing incredible <laughs> in your life. <laughs> no, but I just, I mean, I just look at this beautiful thing and look at the bookmark. And I feel like nothing I could write would be good enough for this you book. You never had a diary? You never no, it. I've never kept a diary. Never. Well, I, well, I, I do. Video it's a video diary. diary. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. It's actually that. part of why I started it. Because I always felt really guilty about not keeping a diary because so many funny things happen here. Hmm. And I want to but, uh, record them. But, but you, you, well, you, you, you are a type with, with, some, with lines. Yeah, this maybe I could make uh, a beautiful like quote. Phrases, yeah, like phrases. Oh, I love yeah. Actually, that would be, that would be yeah. wonderful. Mm -hmm. Or yeah, funny things that have happened. Yeah, yeah Maddie, yes, uh, <laughs> all I want is a little bit of peace and quiet. Yeah, something because you have yeah. them a lot. You say a yeah. lot of things, yeah. also very funny, but also serious. But also yeah. all of the you, the yeah. things yeah. that you say, I could put in here. Yeah, La sure. quote. The things that we say. Yeah. The things <laughs> that you say. I'm going to yeah. be listening. Everybody I'll be has here his waiting. lines, his frames. Yeah. So I think you're right. Okay, this is yeah. going to be the book of Lalande quotes. Yeah, yeah. Paul, thank you. I'm really rather speechless at these. That everything is perfect. Yeah. Thank you so much. The last present of last the day. Last day! Yeah, it's from Poland. Barbara. Oh, yeah. Poland! Yeah. Ooh, there's all sorts of things no. in here! I know. <gasps> Dear Stephanie, thank you for all your vlogs. We, me and my 11 year old daughter Alicia, found your YouTube channel during this year's Easter and we were charmed by it. My daughter told me that because of you, she can dream even mm. bigger. So nice. That makes me really, really happy. This summer holiday we spent in our home country, Poland. We've been living in London since 2004 and we visited some Silesian castles and palaces. As a gift from there, we're sending a hand-painted dish for nibbles made by manufacturers from Bolestarvik city. I'm sorry, I'm probably not pronouncing that at all well. Who continue this tradition of making ceramics derived from the 19th century. Oh. A linen kitchen towel from Zomnika Palace and a traditional Polish plum spread called powita. Also, we thought that sending some Polish sweets for sharing will be a good idea. With yes. best wishes, Barbara and Alicia. I'm so sorry that I am massacring the Polish language right now, and I really apologize for that. It's a country that I very, very much want to visit one day. Yes. Yeah, yeah, well, oh. Look, the Celestian castles and palaces. Oh, <gasps> the yellow one. Have you seen the yellow one? Oh, there. Wow. Oh. oh. Uh oh. 
So <laughs> many castles and palaces. Oh. These are beautiful oh, places. The yes, I know the room. <gasps> wow, what a country. I absolutely want to go one day. Just what a country. I don't know that has so many. Oh, that it. one. So beautiful. I like that one. With the lake. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> With the lake back. That one. We need the lake back. Okay, I'm going to choose mine. You've chosen yours, Philip. Yeah. Ooh, oh, that one, that one is one. pretty good. <laughs> wow. A nice wow. gothic castle would be good. I Actually, like a huge one. yellow palace. Okay, you can live in this yeah. one, Matty. Yellow and orange, that's yours. Yeah, <laughs> I've got to live in a massive yellow and orange palace. <gasps> oh. oh. Wow. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Okay, these are spectacular. I'm going to love this. I book. need one with a beautiful garden, actually. Oh, okay. really? You? I like the one you chose because it was surrounded by trees, but yeah, you wanted a proper garden. Yeah, like you want this, this kind of garden, okay. you know? but not this palace. No, no. I used to play like this. Okay, when I was this a kid. is spectacular. <laughs> Absolutely spectacular. Thank you. Look, little heart-shaped biscuits. <gasps> More. Ooh. Won't these be pretty for Christmas? Ooh. Imagine yeah. if we could like hang these and put them on a tree. They're That's beautiful. They're yeah. so pretty. Like hearts. Why don't we have them Christmas morning? They're so pretty, the little hearts. Butter caramel. Mm. Mm. Mm, look at those, Summer. Butter caramel. Yeah. Plum and Plums. sugar and uh, lemon. Mm. Should we take that down and have it with us for dinner tonight? For dinner? Yeah. I don't know. Does at the end of the know dinner, with cheese. Tonight? No. Cat is cooking. Okay, okay, but and if it doesn't go with that, at the end of dinner with cheese. Yes, yeah. I like your thinking. Yeah. The end of Excellent. With what a goodie bag. Oh, this is the linen. This is the linen for the kitchen. Is it a tea towel? Wow, yes, it's a tea towel. But look oh. at that on it. Flowers. Yes. yes. My grandparents had those in the in the garden. They didn't plant them. They just grew. They just grew. And all the little honeybees would come and go into the little flowers. Yes. The little bells. Yeah. Beautiful. It's beautiful. It's, that is beautiful. Mm -hmm. And mummy will love this because she loves linen. Because the ones in our kitchen get a lot of use and they yeah. don't stay beautiful for long. So no. I think that yeah. for mummy, it's too nice for our oh. kitchen. And Come this is the in. place that continues the 19th century traditions in Poland. Look! Oh! oh. It's really sweet. Oh, it is. I like this size Handmade as Handmade well. in Poland. Do you know what? It even goes in the microwave, in the oven, in the dishwasher. <laughs> we love that. Yeah, yeah, right. We love this <laughs> light. More now. <laughs> I do think that's so pretty. Let's see what it looks like with mince pies on it. Everything looks better with a mince pie. <laughs> oh, look, it's so pretty. Barbara and Alicia, I wish you were with us to be able to enjoy the mince pies with us. Thank you so much. This has been a box of goodies and we're already fighting over the book. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all of you so yeah, very much you because you. it's just been the best. I mean, so, yeah, amazing. So like, yeah. Honestly, I don't think Philip's going to let go of that squirrel for some <laughs> time. <laughs> Let's go to frame it. No. <laughs> Thank, Thank you to you. all of you. Yeah. Oh, lots of love from La Land.